where investors incite an investment on Friday, March to the real estate and wealth management firm's asset in Kilimani in a bid to recover their investment. The Office of the Official Receiver in Insolvency granted the liquidation of the site and high-yield solutions, paving way for a possible recovery of the monies invested by creditors. Prior to this, Saiten had in 2021 applied for administration, a move that the creditors didn't feel worked to the benefit of the creditors and investors. Through their advocate in May 2022, they applied in court to have the official receiver as the liquidator. The Kilimani land is said to be valued at 3 billion shillings. Uh, at one point in 2020, my mom got unwell and uh, I needed some money to facilitate her treatment. And I, I, I met Dan that day. We, we, he comes to the Nairobi club, which I also visit. And I thought I could talk to him at least on uh, compassionate ground. He gave me some of the money. I told him to give me at least 30 percent to, to facilitate treatment in India. But he refused. He was so heartless. He was very ignorant. He called me a slay queen or a drama queen. It was so unfortunate. Finally, we managed, but mom unfortunately passed on. May she rest in peace. We have gone to the DCI. We have gone to the CMA. We have literally walked the journey to recover our money, but it is the court under Justice Mabea that eventually saved us. The files at DCI are still uh, pending open, and we are always asking ourselves, why aren't the promoters of Cyton being taken to task for what they have put us through? As per the account, they say we are 4,000 investors. Uh, you can imagine 4,000 people who have put in their money. What uh, Edwin Dande counts as 15 billion shillings, uh, being taken around by just one individual. The whole board of Cyton resigned and disappeared into the woods. They've just left one person who has taken advantage of a judicial system where he has learned the loopholes. Every time we are bound to do something, he discovers the loopholes and goes to court and gets uh, orders to stop our pursuit.